You go work at McDonald's. If you live long enough, you, you'll make a million dollars. I want to take success that I know is in my future. How many believe you know success is in your future? Okay. Maybe. Everybody in the room is going to make a million dollars. You're, in your lifetime, all you got to do is keep doing what you've been doing. Keep doing that raggedy ass job you got right now and you're going to make a million dollars. You go work at McDonald's. If you live long enough, you, you'll make a million dollars. The average hourly rate for McDonald's Corporation employees make $9.64. $9.64 times 40 hours a week equals $385.60. $385.60 times 52 weeks a year equals $20,000. 1 million divided into $20,000 equals 50 years. That means it would take 50 years for you to make a million dollars. And that's saying you'd never spend money on anything else. But here's what you got to do. The successful people do this. They take what's going to happen in the future and they bring it to today. Okay? I don't want to be a millionaire 40 years from now. If you make 50 grand a year for the next 20 years, you make a million dollars. Just do the math, folks. People are not doing the math on money. You need to do the math on the money. And by the way, the money needs to be something that you're actually playing the game for. There's nothing, there's nothing wrong with you being rewarded with money. How many of you would do better things with money if you had more money? How many of you would actually give money away? Yeah, but you see, see right now, most of you in the room are generous. You see some homeless dude and you're like, here man, here's five. But you can only do it once because your pockets are flat. There's no roll anywhere, okay? Look, 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 you live on a planet called Earth. Planet Earth is a, is a, it's a brutal place to live and nobody told you. Nobody told you. This is a brutal place to live, folks. And somehow along the line, you got used to eating at McDonald's and Taco Bell, okay? You got, you got used to waiting in line and driving cars that are beat up. You got used to making excuses. You got used to eating at the Olive Garden and getting coupons and clipping coupons because you watch your mommy and daddy clip coupons and shame on your mommy and daddy for not busting out and finding a vehicle so they didn't have to clip coupons. You got used to because your mom and daddy taught you because your mom and daddy didn't have a vehicle to get out of and or they didn't jump on the vehicle. So all the role models around you are who? No, 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 but I'm just one person, man. But the truth is, your neighborhood are your mentors. People, every day, people are like, man, will you be my mentor? Dude, you got to get rid of your neighborhood first, bro. You got to get responsibility for your neighborhood. You got to get responsible for your friends and your cousins and your uncles and your aunts. So pick somebody in your damn phone. And that's what the phone's for, by the way. It's for calling people, not looking at pictures. Okay? Pick up the phone right now. Call somebody and say, hey, I'm picking you up Monday, bro. Okay, y'all ready? Three, two, one, hit it.